feeling connected, joyful, respect, laughter, community, collaborating, fun. In our community, in our business, it's important that people work well together. The better people work together, the more efficient our systems can be, which enables us to do our work better and have greater impact. And so sometimes that means having fun together. So, because when people play together, they get to know each other and connect in ways that are just really insightful and interesting and sometimes very deep. So recently, for example, we went to have a cooking class. It provided this great opportunity for people to be together, to learn together, to connect more deeply with each other, to have fun and build the strength of our community. <laughs> There's a sense of real connection and I think love between all the people that work here. This is a chance to really feel that all together and mix it up in different ways. Different people are at different stations. Don't cut me. And connect in a different way than we do just in the workplace. <laughs> to be able to do the work we do, the culture is really critical. And I think we get a lot more done as a result of that culture and of the feelings we have for each other. I love the fact that we can all interact with each other. I mean, you know, I work and I go do checks and I write them and I take off, but this, today's like this are just wonderful, being able to work with the people in a different way than with my bookkeeping. You know, fun and creativity and just companionship, it's, it's awesome. There's a concept that we've talked about over the years, relational reserves. So if you spend time, unstructured time, where you're simply connecting with someone and getting to know who they are, what they care about, you're building up a reserve that you can actually call upon when things do get stressful, when things go wrong, when problems arise that need to be figured out. And so that unstructured, quote unquote, fun time is a part of building up that relational reserve, that capacity for us to really know and understand and trust one another as whole human beings. I see joyfulness. I see laughter. I see people willing to step outside of their comfort zone, extending themselves to each other, conversation happening while people are cooking and learning and filleting and chopping. And <laughs> That event alone captures nicely the things we're trying to achieve in our culture. <laughs>